morning, Jamaica. Uh, so yeah, we just got up. We're about to head down to breakfast. We just wanted to share this amazing view with you guys and let you guys just see like it's fucking beautiful out here. I hit that water today. We hit that water today. We finna hit them all inclusive bars down there yes, and sir. we finna get sauced up. So uh, yeah, y'all pay attention because like my wife said yesterday, feeling I ain't drunk today. We ain't drunk today. We feel better now. <laughs> we finna shake this fucking island up. Yes. <laughs> so since um, room service is finally up. I want to give you guys a quick tour of the room so you can guys can see our honeymoon suite. All right, so when you walk in, first things first, you walk in, you got the asylum where it says, kind of lets everybody know that we're on our honeymoon, so we're not the butlers or the people come up to your room and stuff. They know you're in a honeymoon. They say congratulations, all kind of stuff. Be merry, be happy. When you walk into the room, immediately panning, you pan to the right. You can see my beautiful wife. All right, so we got this beautiful spa tub. Fits two people with Whirlpool Jets. You got your his and her sinks. You see, we done made ourselves comfortable. That's me, you guys know me. <laughs> Take a look here, you have your bathroom with the telephone. This is the best shower in the world. Opens up, shower. With the, with the rain uh, waterfall overhead shower. And just to continue, guys, here's the bed. King size bed, extremely comfortable pillow top. We actually were really lucky when we checked in. They were able to give us one of the rooms that were newly renovated. Uh, no one stayed in this room since it's been renovated. We're in room 3515 at St. James Secrets. So yeah, just some painting on the wall. There's a lot of lighting in the room. I'll show you the rooms uh, at night tonight. We come out here to the patio, it's a little seating area. It's really nice. We've been smoking our lives away. Come out here, guys. The pool is pretty lively right now. Look at that view, though. Like, that view is amazing. And you have to see it, like, in the room. This is the whole secret St. James Resort. I'll check back in with you guys a little bit later, right? All right, guys. Me and Bay just left the patio of the suite, and um, we are banged. <laughs> this Jamaican herb is not playing. It don't really give me like that euphoric head high that I'm accustomed to in the States. That's me. But it kind of gives me that, it gives me that bitch put some food in my belly. Like for real, like that's what it I'm high as fuck, but it's more of a feed me so I can go to sleep. And I need to be turned the fuck up. Oh, we won't. Oh, no. Sorry. Oops. <laughs> she been drinking her ass off, you guys. What's up, Snapchat? Okay. Me and the beautiful. Yeah, baby. What's up, babe? I'm recording you too. <laughs> yeah, Snapchat, so me and the beautiful wife, he's out here chilling poolside. I took a look at both. Everybody in the pool relaxing. Y'all don't see her better, that's, that's the beautiful, delicious. She's in charge of the entertainment here at the pool. She's gonna have a dancing class at three and a couple's game at 11 called uh, Minute to Win It. That was a good time today. Yeah, they like two, probably three drinks in right now. She two drinks in, I'm three drinks in. We finally got to the room relaxing a little bit. Happened to meet you happy outside all damn day. I did have an outside all day. I just got too hot. <laughs> she smoked too much of the damn Jamaican ganja and wanted to just stay in the room. So we ended up like this morning, I don't know if I told you guys, um, we went kayaking this morning. It was Crystal's first time ever doing it. It was a beautiful experience. The water out here is so clear. You can literally see to the bottom. So like we're out there kayaking and we can see like the full reef and the fit. It was pretty amazing. Um, uh, we played some games by the pool. Crystal beat everybody. All right. 
dinner time. I'm about to go to this restaurant called the El Patio. It's supposed to be like Tex-Mex cuisine. It's, we'll see what they got going, you know? They looking good. She got on a little white bustier and some little shorts, some little tie up gladiators. All right, well, I'll let you guys know how the food goes. And you know, I'm gonna give my critiques. Two seconds. tell you guys about the food um, quickly um, <clears throat> I know I've been saying like some of the food has been a little off I will say this we just left the Mexican restaurants the first time we tried food that wasn't like Jamaican food in Jamaica but the Mexican restaurant was amazing the, the flank steak very tender nice medium temp cook on it it was really good um, I had this fried snapper and like some red pepper sauce or something I don't know it was like <laughs> yellow rice it was it was good it was fucked up uh, with two, uh, we had two frozen strawberry margaritas, but uh, they both gave us brain freeze to make us cry because we old as fuck. And brain freeze ain't like when you was little. When you get old, the brain freeze hurts so motherfucking bad. Like, they make you want to die. Like, I thought I was going to die at that table. So now we went back to home to recap, regroup, and figure out what we're doing tonight. So, heading to the gift shop because uh, Bay's having some teeth pains. And uh, we need some night protein. Cause you know, like I know, them damn teeth pains can ruin the whole trip. 